reproduction in animals hey jia you know our pet dog has given birth to four puppies really dodo wow dodo our dog has given birth to puppies so this is called reproduction oh i see so let's step ahead to learn more about it yes friends come let's learn types of reproduction living things reproduce to give birth to babies of their own kind this process helps to continue life on earth animals reproduce in two ways one by laying eggs and second by giving birth to babies some animal babies look similar to their parents when they are born some animal babies look very different from their parent when born they start resembling their parents as they grow animals such as birds lay eggs to reproduce these eggs need to be kept warm till they hatch once the eggs hatch the young ones come out birds build nests to lay eggs and raise their young ones other animals who lay eggs are insects reptiles and amphibians structure of an egg embryo the embryo goes through various stages of development inside the egg and then hatches out as a chick chick is looked after by the parent birds till it learns to fly like an adult egg shell an egg has a thin but hard outer covering called the egg shell that protects its inner soft parts albumin inside the egg shell there is albumin the albumin is a white jelly like substance that is rich in proteins egg yolk the egg yolk is the inner yellow part of the egg it is rich in fats vitamins and minerals and provides food to the growing baby life cycle the baby animals once born keep growing till they grow into adult animals the various stages of development that growing baby goes through to become an adult is called life cycle of an animal let's look at the life cycles of some more animals life cycle of a butterfly butterfly lays an egg the egg hatches into caterpillar The caterpillar eats many leaves and grow big and strong. The caterpillar makes a pupa. A beautiful butterfly appears and the cycle starts all over again. Life cycle of a frog. Frog lays eggs in ponds in large clusters called spawns. These eggs hatch to become tadpoles which look very different from the adult frog. They undergo metamorphosis to grow into adult frog. Life cycle of a house fly. The house fly lays hundreds of eggs at a time. Each egg hatches to produce a young one called larva. The larva of a house fly is called maggot. After some days the larva becomes barrel shaped it is now called pupa the cocoon breaks open in a week and young house fly comes out life cycle of a grasshopper an egg turns into a nymph about 2 weeks later a young grasshopper known as nymph develops from an egg it does not have wings it sheds it skin several times and changes into an adult this adult process of shedding the old skin is called molting reptiles snake snakes lay eggs on the ground turtles turtles and crocodiles dig shallow snake turtles crocodiles form a group of animals called reptiles 
Animals that give birth to babies. Animals which give birth to young ones and feed them with their milk are called mammals. For example, cow, goat, dog, cat, horse, etc. The babies of all animals need food, shelter and protect from enemies. The parents take care of their young ones. Animals such as birds make nests to lay eggs. The parents take care to keep the eggs warm and safe from other animals and they bring food for their young babies. They also help the young birds to fly and care them till they leave the nest. Let's recall. Animals reproduce in two ways, either by laying eggs or by giving birth to babies. Birds, insects and amphibians reproduce by laying eggs. An egg has a thin outer covering called the eggshell, a white part called the albumen and the yellow colored egg yolk. The various stages of development that a growing baby goes through to become an adult called the life cycle of an animal. Some animals such as butterflies and frogs undergo a complete transformation through their various stages of development. Mammals reproduce by giving birth to young ones of their own kind. The young ones feed on the mother's milk. Animal babies are looked after by their parents. They feed them, keep them warm and protect them from enemies till they are able to care for themselves. Thank you.